One of the things I don't do is to throw away leftover Ankara fabric. No, I don't do that. And that's because I know somehow, someday, they will be very useful. All over the world, no world looks like you. You can put a smile on your face. You're beautiful. Welcome to my channel. Okay, so I'll be making use of leftover Ankara fabric, red chilling, bony, and your mineral wire. In case of um, if you don't have a mineral wire, you may want to use your red chilling bony. Okay, it's just that they have different effects. Okay, so this is the leftover Ankara fabric, and I just um, made I cut them. Um, eight inches on four that's two inches of width and one inch for length okay you can do however you want it but this is just the process i may do in this video so i just went ahead to cut other fa the other color fabrics like that and so after stitching the edges i just turned over to the other side okay so this is the millinery or art wire and what i did is the edges are kind of pointed and sharp so i just wrapped them with cotton wool okay if you don't have cotton wool you can also bend the edge of the millinery wire you know like this will bend the edge like this so that it won't have that sharp edge okay so i'm just going to insert them into the ankara fabric i already made and this is also the original bony i talked about at the beginning you know i said i'm going to use it for different effect um, i also inserted into the ankara fabric and so i have done all of that i've done the ankara fabric i've inserted the bony as well you know these two, the boning and the millinery wire, they have different effects which you will see in this video, okay? Look at this one, I put um, the millinery or hat wire inside and it has this pointed edge, I could, you know, shape it as I want to, but this one with the original boning is just rounded, it doesn't have a flat edge like the one I used the wire for. I hope you can see the difference, okay, so this leaf effect only comes out with the millinery wire okay so what I'm doing right now is just to add the will I say leaves now <laughs> together I'm going to just stitch them together with needle and thread you know why doing this you need to be careful so that you don't injure yourself with the needle because you really be you know adding them together with the needle and thread well I thought when I was making this there was no light so I I would have used a a glue gum to also gum together for more firmness but since I secured very well with the needle and thread I'm sure it's very strong so I do not have to worry so I've joined like four together you know the truth is I really didn't know what I wanted to do with this design so I was just doing try by error like okay whatever design that comes out with this I'll make do with it and that is what creativity and innovation is all about you just have to be creative and innovative to just bring something beautiful out so I well I was like okay let me arrange five up let me arrange five down do something in the center you know I was just you know working with it and well they really turned out to be nice at the end of the day okay so I did one half like I think I joined like five together and this two I'm going to do the same and I'm just going to join them together Ankara leftover fabrics can really be very useful, so don't throw away your leftover pieces. Even when you give it fashion designer, your clothes, just tell them, yeah, the pieces, don't worry, I will keep them. Something good will definitely come out. Okay, so I'm just stitching the two together, you know. I did one half, this is another half, and I'm just going to stitch them together. Look at them, oh my god, looking beautiful already, looking beautiful already, so... I'm just going to arrange, expand, reset, you understand now, just to give it something very fine. You can't even want to leave it like that, you are good to go. Okay, so this is the other one that I use regional bony to do. One thing I love about regional bony is that it is very flexible, you can easily work with it, a needle can go through it, yes, the needle can go through it, and so that is what I'm just doing, yes, look at the way I created this design, I tacked the edges of the stuff together and I just put it into true 
in the middle and look at what we have here it's nice so this can also form another design like i said it can be very creative it doesn't have to come out like this like mine you can do whatever you want you can make it stand like that you can make yours bend like that so what i did was to also do another something similar to that cut it now so you can you can arrange it however you want just to give it something very nice if you just do this you are even good to go because this is very very beautiful already but i'm going to do an ankara um flower with my fabric and what i did was i think i cut like um three inches on four for the width that's making six inches you can see that and i just joined the other ankara the, i use different i mean you know i use different kind of ankara actually my kind of ankara fabric for the dress for the i mean for the fascinator so i i mixed it together to do the ankara flower to do the ankara flower that is what i did there and as you can see i just um you know did a sharp edge by the edge because i'm going to to just um to sew it and it will form a flower you can you will see that very soon if this is your first time on this channel i'm so glad to have you here do not forget to subscribe for new exciting videos so that you can easily get your notification and to those who already subscribed oh my god i'm so glad to have you ah we have a very good ride together i'm sure of that Right, so I'm just going to join the three pieces together. You can see that, and um, I'm going to fold, and I'm just going to start sewing with my needle and thread, my black thread finished. That's why I'm using this yellow thread. Yes, yeah, so I've just done that, and what I'm going to do next is just to draw it. I'm going to draw the thread to form this flower i hope you can see that it's actually a nice one uh, well i you can put an already made flower i just wanted to use the ankara scrap to do a flower and this is my band my Alice band and i'm just trying to use that mannequin to know where i want to fix the fascinator which is already almost made you can also use your head as sample okay so this i'm just going to use it to cover the back of the fascinator like so to close the um, rough edges i mean the stitches and to make it neater so i've just done that stitch together and here we go this is beautiful so beautiful thank you for watching see you